Vicki. Well, imagine paying less than a penny a gallon when you fill up at the gas pump. This story's getting lots of buzz. Ms. Cheap found a Nashville man who does just that, and he's not keeping his money-saving secrets to himself. John Raymond says you can do it, too, and he's about to show you how. I just really carefully wait for the four times fuel points for gift cards. Typically, I'll get 200 to 250 fuel points every month just to fill out a free survey. It looks like it's going to be about $2 a gallon, which is about the price of what the fuel is today. So 35 gallons is what the maximum is, and fortunately, uh, We'll get away with maybe spending 35, 50 cents, maybe a dollar for all 35 gallons. So how many tanks you got? Well, I have five tanks here. Each one, a portable tank, will hold five gallons. And that's the recommended uh, maximum here in the state of Tennessee of portable gas transport without a special sticker and a commercial uh, sticker. Uh, furthermore, I always bring my pickup truck and I always make sure that I've got at least 10 gallons that I need to put in there. So 10 plus the 25 in portable equals the 35. It just took my Kroger card. Now it's going to ask for me to uh, input to either prepay or insert a way to pay. And I use a uh, credit card and uh, the purpose for that is I always am able to uh, stay at motel rooms for nothing since my wife and I like to travel. Now what's, what's interesting is you have a choice. You can, I can save up to $2.30 a gallon, but gas here is only $1.96.9. So I can use the full amount, I can change the amount, or just get the standard three cents off a gallon because I have a card. I'm going to press the number two to change the amount, and then I have to put in anywhere from 10 cents off to $2.30 off. So since fuel is $1.96, I'm going to put in $2 or $200 here. And what that should do is to give me 30 cents off before the end of this month. And um, what you see here is the cost of my fuel per gallon cost of fuel per gallon for 35 gallons is nine tenths of one cent. So it's not quite free, but it's about as close as you can get. Okay, I, I should probably be able to put in about at least eight gallons and perhaps 10 if I've measured, estimated my uh, fuel correctly in my truck. So. And when my truck is full, my wife will follow me in her car. And between the two cars and the five 25 uh, gallons of portable tanks, then we have our 35 gallons. So I always put 35 gallons in because that's the maximum. That's the maximum savings. So if you have 35 gallons and it costs you nine tenths of a penny, well, that's, uh, that's, uh, $70 I saved today.